Howdy YouTube. Today we're talking about ratchet strap and binder maintenance. Let's get to it. Like I said, we're working on ratchet strap and chain binder maintenance. And all you need, there's, I guess, four things. Two of them are right here, gloves and your hands. And then PB blaster, it's my favorite. And fluid film, if you don't know about fluid film, go to your, I think, Napa and AutoZone sell them maybe walmart not a sponsor but i found this on another youtube channel years ago decided to try and it is awesome stuff so go pick yourself up a can anyways i'm going to show you how to keep your ratchet straps and chain binders all lubed and good to use Let's start with the ratchet strap. Okay. <clears throat> the PB blaster, that's not what you use for lube. That will evaporate and wash off in the rain and you know, it, it's almost useless as a lubricant. Now, this looks crusty and disgusting. You know, so you would think it's seized up looking at it, but with the fluid film, Even it's, it's it's dry, it's rusty, but it still works. So, if these were seized up, any of these or whatever, that's what you use the flu the PB blaster for. So, even if they're getting kind of junky, what I do, I'll show you, even though it doesn't need it. Just take your PB blaster and anything that moves, just spritz it down inside now we'll go move on to the binder spray that's what sticks mostly on ratchet binders so spray that you can unwind those and spray the shafts and for these lever binders just if they get rusty you know none of these need pb blaster i was just showing you so the lube part comes in, so if, make sure if they were rusty, you do that a bunch and keep spraying them with BB Blaster to break them free. So the lube part comes in, fluid film. I'm gonna take your gloves off. It's kind of weird looking, but it smells good. So that's always a plus. All you gotta do is shake it up and then do the same technique. Now this stuff is, it can be a little bit messy. So be gingerly with it. open it up real quick. Open. So, fluid film. There's that little ball in there that lets you lets this ratchet and lets you switch directions that's my biggest pain that's what seems to stick the most on ratchet binders now just to make it easier to ratchet 
just spray the threads a little bit. And so this, all you do is, you know, run them back and forth if you need to. Those will stay lubed. Ratchet strap, like before. Back and forth. That'll stay lubed. And the, the fluid film sticks. It lasts a good while. A lot of people I know use uh, use motor oil. That's a little bit more dirty, in my opinion, but it works. I've just always liked fluid film, and it, I don't know, I think it might do a little better than the oil, I don't know, but that's just my personal opinion. Now, the ratchet binders, just take your thumb and your finger, make sure that's free, make sure it ratchets, and then you could ratchet these in and out a little bit with a rub rail or twirling them in the air or whatever but that'll get them lubed up inside now i with the ratchets i like to store them with the threads in that way it keeps the lube inside and also makes a little bit more room in your toolbox so there you go that's the maintenance for ratchet straps lever binders chain binders PB blaster if they're seized up and uh, fluid film to keep them unseized and nice and lubed and easy to use so thanks for watching don't forget to like share subscribe for more and follow me on Facebook and Instagram it's K30 crazy and uh, as always stay crazy have a good one